Hello everyone, welcome to our English learning channel. Have you ever heard about the term TPEC or Technological Pedagogical Content Knowledge? Yeah, in digital era or 21st century educational transformations are the eras of change where teachers and students will play an important role in learning activities. The role of teacher is not only as a transfer of knowledge, but also as a mediator and active facilitator to develop the active potentials of students themselves. This rapid change has consequences for teachers, prospective teachers, and education practitioners to constantly update their abilities in mastering ICT to be used as supporting media in learning activities. Therefore, the latest learning issues and trends state that a teacher must have competence on technological, pedagogical, and content knowledge or abbreviated as TPEC. Now, take a look at this picture. This picture shows that there are three main points of TPEC. The first is technological knowledge or TK, then content knowledge or CK, and pedagogical knowledge or PK. Then what are they? Technological knowledge includes understanding on how to use computer software and hardware, presentations equipment such as presentation document, and other technologies in context of education. TK also covers the ability to adapt and learn new technology. The existence of this capability needs to be held in a view of ongoing developments and technological changes. For example, the development of computers that are constantly changing from the personal computer or PC to current notebook. Yet, these computers can be used for a variety of pedagogical tasks such as research, communications, and others. Then we have what is called as content knowledge or CK. CK leads to knowledge or specificity of disciplines or subject matters. CK is different at each level, examples of difference in primary and secondary schools. A teacher is expected to master this knowledge to teach. CK is also important because it determines the specificity of thinking from certain disciplines in each study. What about PK or pedagogical knowledge? It describes the general goal of specificity of knowledge to teach. It is a collection of skills that a teacher must develop in order to be able to manage and organize teaching and learning activities to achieve the expected learning goals. This knowledge includes understanding classroom management activities, the role of students' motivations, lesson plans, and learning assessments. PK also describes the knowledge of different teaching methods, including knowledge to know how to organize activities in a classroom so that the constructions of students' knowledge or learning is more conducive. Then, when you have understood those three main points of TPEC's framework, then you can understand further about what is called as TPEC itself. So TPEC describes the knowledge of synthesized from each field of knowledge that has been described previously, including TK, CK, and PK, that focusing on how technology can be made specific, which is suitable with a pedagogical need to teach the right content in a particular context. Each element of knowledge field describes a need and the importance of this aspect in teaching. Yet, for effective teaching requires more than each part of it. For teachers with technological pedagogical content knowledge or TPEC, technology knowledge, pedagogy, and content are synthesized and used to design students' learning experiences. TPEC framework also functions as a theory and concept for researchers and educators in measuring the readiness of prospective teachers and teachers to teach effectively with technology. So, there, there is a need of a relationship between technology, pedagogy, and inherent content. 
Therefore, teachers face major challenges in shifting technological change, pedagogy, subject matter, and current class context. Teachers should be active and more curious to design the curriculum of their class. So those are all a very brief discussions about what is called as TPEC. Thank you and see you later.